the Starcraft screen so you don't have to look at me anymore and there we go counting down on Cloud Kingdom for game number two between Is No Best and Be Black All right, and here in the top corner of Cloud Kingdom, we have the Terran player currently being up 1-0. It is Is No Best. And if you're only a little bit biased towards Terran, please give a cheer for Terran. Okay, not. <laughs> Translation for the non-Dutch audience: Is no best is saying your mother has a mustache. A be back claiming that said mustache is quite imba and that he is not worried about it at all. And of course, if anyone knows anything about imba, it would of course be is the best because we all know Darren is imba. Okay, okay that's so uh, be back down one game. He actually managed to hold on very, very well the last game. Eventually, he's had to tap out. Uh, now, Cloud Kingdom, of course, is um, a little easier on the third, of course, for uh, both players. So, uh, I think of the will once again see a bit of a macro game. Uh, who do you think will do that uh, kind of style will favor? Um, you said in the, uh, the, uh, before the game started that you did an interview with B Black where you said he had some uh, injuries to his hands and that he preferred some shorter games. Well, he, he preferred something uh, he said his, uh, his speed was, uh, kind of was uh, a bit diminished. Um, so he's not uh, quite at his uh, normal level. But I think, uh, oh, once again, it's the best uh, to go out with his uh, SVO. Let us see. I am curious if he's uh, going to try the same trick as he did in game one. It wouldn't surprise me. We've seen it uh, before. Uh, also in the previous series between Isno Best and B Black, he uh, tried his uh, bunkers even when he didn't uh, commit to the pressure, uh, just to uh, annoy his opponent a little bit, force him to pull some drones. Yep. And, and here we go again. again. Yeah, but it's in uh, full vision of uh, B Black. And uh, once again, only uh, two drones uh, coming out is uh, not a product uh, at all. Uh, let's see if the SCV. Uh, no, the SCV is uh, more than. Uh, able to be uh, harassed by those uh, looks. He's uh, doing some micro to uh, try and uh, as best he might. To get, oh, and he gets stuck. But he Mineral walks actually. through and oh, his SUV no. is getting low. Uh, will he flee or will he finish the bunker? No, he actually flees. So this bunker will just be uh, annoying and in the way for a while. Uh, and B Black didn't overreact. He only uh, he pulled two drones. I uh, didn't lose too much mining time and uh, both players end up quite even after this exchange. Yep. Uh, another once again factory coming out here uh, for Isno Best. Uh, let's see if we can we see some uh, more Hellion press in the first game. The first game only was like a couple of Hellions, but combined uh, with those Marines and uh, Medifacts uh, to make really make a full on push. Uh, let's see if he this time he goes to uh, decides to make. Oh, he's loses Overlord. There was an Overlord yes. killed by two Marines here. Isno Best knows his timings, knows when the Overlords arrive here at this nice little ledge to. Uh, <laughs> Uh, uh, to have vision. He <laughs> <laughs> didn't really need it. It's too low. Of course, he really needs it in the game. And that's going to be uh, <laughs> quite a damper on the economy of B Black in the game. <laughs> B Black doesn't think too highly of his overlords. Uh, they're cannon fodder. They're just pussies. Yeah, yeah, and no matter how much the turn would, uh, would cry in by over the new overlord speed, it wasn't quite enough to save that one. But look at how fast they are. They're like, like rocket ships these days. <laughs> well, that's your opinion. <laughs> Yep, yep, and there we see Director the Hellion coming out uh, of SMS 1 Hellion and the first, and of course expanding right behind it. Yeah, so it's a very standard opening from our Terran player. The Hellions will be used for some uh, very light pressure, maybe, uh, definitely for map control. He'll try to uh, deny the creep, but with Queens now having range 5, they are no longer uh, kiteable by the Hellions like they once were. So uh, B Black should be able to uh, not lose too much uh, to this, unless Isno Best decides to commit with Hellions. But he seems to be making only two and has stopped Hellion production for now. Yeah, and I'm kind of curious to here for uh, B Black deciding to go for some uh, ba for bailing this. So uh, I think uh, this might be the game where we see the bailing burst he promised us. Uh, but of course, with Ismus going for Hellions, that's going to be quite tricky to get up that rep and really do the damage he needs to, because that is quite an arrow choke. Uh, here come the Hellions, we'll see how much pressure he wants to put on. There's only a single Queen to defend here, and he may be able to get a couple drone kills. Uh, Queen's now chasing, yeah, first drone goes, goes down. First. 
Maybe Black like, Green just spreads those. Oh, these uh, Marco and Black especially can. A lot. To another. Oh, no. Yep. There goes oh, another. two more. And there comes the circle. Can he get this around? No, those early spaces are way too quickly for the circle. That's the speed just hadn't finished yet. There comes the speed. That's uh, only five seconds that it needed to. But uh, it just gets out of there with a couple of trophies. It's only one uh, SCV in this refinery at the moment. I'm not sure if that's a mistake or deliberate. Uh, I think it's the best knows what he's doing. It's uh, deliberate. All right then. Okay, okay and there comes the, some uh, Marines in the tank. And uh, siege mode is lined up to be complete uh, right now, so we'll be able to uh, lay siege to this uh, to this base. Uh, actually, in the uh, group stage B, we saw Is No Best playing B Black also on Cloud Kingdom, and there uh, Is No Best did a uh, reactor Hellion expand into a oh tank this push. The reserve is on B Black going all the way around the map, he completely missing the push there by Is No Best. He might be able to pick up some reinforcements, but there's nothing here to stop uh, the push from Is No Best from going down. He so may go for a flank, but he's going into the base. In the meantime, Siege has started up with bunkers going up. Uh, that part is an exact mirror of the previous game he's to played on Cloud Kingdom, but the wall is up here and B Black cannot get in. Yeah, it's uh, getting the Zerg is coming in, but he need, really needs to take this thing down. But uh, it's, oh, there is a miss ready. It's, it's mainly there morphing, but it's not quite enough. Uh, another band is being seized on. Oh, and he's going for the bust. Oh, this wall will go down, and Isno Best is quickly uh, reinforcing, building whatever buildings he can behind the wall. But here come the bane links. Oh, is it going to be? Is it going to be enough? Supply block for Isno Best. Oh, yes, all the one is going straight to the middle of the line. And here go the SCVs. Oh. And there's a bunker up for Isno Best that will uh, allow him to hold a bit more, but the bunker is going down. SCV is not able to repair as much as they want to. But is this bunker going down? It's no, the, the bunker holds. holds and and well that ends the push for B Black. And while Isno Best now cleans up the natural from B Black. That's so B Black is surrendering his natural. He knows he has done uh, enough damage. Wants to hold the main. Ooh, there's only seven uh, workers left for Isno Best. And two of them are here at the push. So uh, Isno Best is completely all in right now. He's not building additional workers. And this will have to be the push. But the problem is that he cannot get high ground vision. And as soon as uh, B Black extends the creep to this area, uh, exactly what he's doing now, uh, he'll be able to put spine crawlers here and uh, kill everything that tries to get up the ramp. Yeah, so B Black is in a very comfortable position, yeah, I think. Oh, there's one tank on seats. And there he goes for it. There's bay legs. Here come the bay legs. One tank goes down. Marines making a beeline for the bunker. And they do get in. But the tanks are down, and now all that Instobest has left is this bunker, two Hellions and a uh, two SCVs and a Hellion here at this push. Yeah, yeah but of course uh, Instobest still managed to keep B Black in his base, so he has at least a chance to get back into this game economically. Still prison four Marines at the time, uh, so I think he uh, is kind of gearing up for a bit of a push later on. He stops the bunker and gives up on the pressure, leaving uh, B Black to do whatever he pleases. Yeah, Instobest has resumed SCV production, so he wants to uh, extend this game longer, and it was a bit of a crazy exchange between these two players but if we uh, took a look at the work accounts right now we see that it is 14 SCVs for is no best and 26 drones for B Black and B Black moving out to the map once again taking the Sonata Tower that Hellion is gonna go down and the Zerg is getting a, bit, getting a bit of revenge for the fallen comrades and yeah B Black uh, now containing is no best yeah, so uh, Isno Best won't be able to move out just yet. He's trying to uh, put some Marines on the map, maybe wants to take that expansion. Uh, but these uh, Zerglings may have something to say about that, but I don't think there's enough uh, Zerglings. Oh, is it going to be enough? Some so micro from Isno Best. Isno Best is migrating like crazy, and it really looks like he's going to get out of there. This is some crazy oh. And... There's a tank here on the high ground yeah, helping out. Three Marines survive. But the, th but the thing here is, with B Black being so far ahead on economy, he can afford to have these trades. He can lose more units than his opponents because yeah, he has more uh, resources. And there comes a spire. Work count right now is actually evened up. Uh, uh, B Black has not been producing many drones, but now he's getting some more uh, drone yeah, cycles out of his life. Oh, but is the best is going for yet another push. And this is uh, a moment where B Black is quite vulnerable. Oh, he's droning up, he's making a spire, investing a lot of resources in tech and economy rather than in army. Yeah, of course, it's only one tank uh, now, so if uh, 
B Black can just get one round of uh, one good round of service out. He's uh, probably gonna have enough to hold this off. He sees uh, it at the watchtower. Uh, tries to almost tries to intercept the tank. Will he get the tank? Will be amazing. Oh, and the tank goes down. But here's tank number two, and more circling is coming out now for B Black. Just not enough for B Black at the moment. He really needs those larvae to be eight. Six mules coming out. Still five larvae available for B Black, but he doesn't have much resources right now. Evacuates the natural, loses a couple of drones on the retreat. He will lose the natural hatch uh, before the Mulisk and Zerklings yeah, come out. Yes, Mulisk can get all of those tanks. Uh, in there could be more than two holders. There comes Zerklings the coming down. Uh, they're not. The tank is not completely in range. The range only ends here, uh, but it's not enough Zerklings to clean this up. Oh, there comes the Mulisk. Is it going to be enough to kill the? No, there goes the natural. It's not in time. The Brutlings, Brutlings buffering for the Mulisk, and all the Marines will go down. Yes. And only one, one mule list was lost, I believe. Okay, that's not really that bad for B-Black. Now the chase by the tank and map control firmly back into the hands of B-Black, who once again just makes a lot of runs to uh, go back to the But if you take a look at supply, Isno Best is actually pulling ahead, and there comes yet another push. And Isno Best is just relentless with the pushing. As soon as one push ends, the next one is already lined up, leaving the base and uh, making sure some damage is done. Some drones on a uh, scenic oh, route through the base. Oh, oh, one mule list goes down, but it does get early warning off this push, and immediately more zerklings are being produced. But with only one, ha uh, two hatcheries, the production for black B black is not so high. Thus, we only use also supply blocks. That yes, is not the best time. And B black once again put in uh, B black circling around, trying to get the name of the bank. Oh, so mule list get away! Oh, and here he loses almost all the mule lists. Some zerklings going in on a rally, and they don't uh, do much. Last mule list goes down. Uh, this single drone is not meant for this world. Uh, <laughs> this is a very nice idea to put spine crawls here on the high ground. There's no high ground vision for it's no best. Going into the third speed like over here, and yep. is forced to abandon uh, one other, just one other base. Yeah, that leaves uh, B Black mining only from his main, while uh, Isno Best has two bases to mine from. But here we see a spine crawler taking oh out a tech. Nice there goes a scan, but it's not enough. Down. And this push has been cleaned up once more. B Black holds. Yeah, but there's still Marines in the third, and that third is going to go down. And Isno Best just uh, once again, as, just as we saw in the first game, just relentlessly pushing down. Some long distance mining from these drones. Yes, some <laughs> long distance mining over there. And is no best wouldn't be is no best if another push uh, wasn't already lining up. And here we go once more. Yeah, this is no best is just continuing to pile on the pressure. And deep, oh, there's we're getting some bane links right now, but will they be on time as this push is almost at the ramp up to the natural? Oh, and I don't think these bane links will be there on time. The tanks will be able to siege up. Oh yeah, those jerks are just going to be cannon for trying to go for the. Here come the bane links! Oh, that's a oh, that's oh. oh. Doesn't get enough out of these bailings, gets some nice connections, but uh, B Black is forced to call. GG and Isno Best stakes game number two. Real good units from Isno Best. One of the messages just at the end uh, that you may not have seen is that Isno Best ended with the uh, Mule good units. When he was down to seven SCVs, uh, the Mules pulled him through.